Yo, 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 yo. Alright, let me make, let me get a party real quick for you guys and then we get Okay. Okay guys. Okay, okay. Like my brain is fried right now. Alright, so this is for the YouTube channel. Uh what's up guys? So I just got done streaming like 13, 14 hours on Twitch. Uh, if you guys are interested in checking out my grind for this Kawhi card, it is on the Twitch. Now, I will admit it was 13 hours, so it, it's pretty dull at times or whatever. But it, I pretty much was just like grinding and breaking down everything I was doing to get like my last 25k XP right. So. Now, um, and I and, and and it's pretty interesting because of the way I had to work with my money. I would buy cars, sell them back, um, and you know, look, I look at it now. Look, I've I've pretty much sold every card back except uh one card I'm that I haven't sold back, which is um, Terrence Ross here. So I pretty much have um, literally uh. I was like at, at certain points of the stream I was like nearing zero MT and at one point I actually was at zero you know just to finish these XP man um but anyways for, we're going to open up this pack Kawhi my connection is slow as why well. it's freaking everything is taking so long to load show sure you guys just what we had to do I'm not going to show you guys everything but literally we, I don't I don't spend money on this game. This is what made it harder for me. If I spent money on this game and I had some really nice cards, this probably would have been a lot easier. But I do not spend that much money on it. I don't spend any money on this game. So here are all cards I bought, sold back, or just already had. And I bought usually the cheaper ones. Like if you look here, like a lot of the... Like I still got a lot of challenges like for Hakeem um retro curry and like you know a lot of these guys bill um you know stockton aldridge a lot of these guys i did not get to and a lot of these bigger challenges like unlimited i didn't get to unlimited i didn't get to do my career i don't even have a my career player i didn't get to do weber because he was like the cha he was obviously one of the super hard cars to get last season um I didn't do the Galaxy Opal board because I didn't have the tokens because I was too busy spending all my tokens on the um, diamond board and the pink diamond board. So I, um, yeah, I didn't, I didn't get the, didn't get to get to the Opal one. But this is what I did get to do though: a lot of moments challenges, a lot of weekly challenges, a lot of uh, player reward challenges, a lot of. Uh, spotlight challenges a lot of win triple triple threat domination the pink the markets and this is a missing a lot of other things that i've completed that disappeared like over like the weekend i, I did like almost all of the weekend challenges and things like that so a lot of work was was done here a lot of work was done here um but anyways yeah just um yeah, let's let's open this Kawhi, man. Check them out. Also, while while I'm talking about it, I should I'm gonna be opening some of these badge packs. I got all these badge packs from playing Triple Threat offline. If you want to get badges, Triple Threat offline is the way to go. But here we go. We're opening Kawhi, man. Like my brain is fried. Like I was third on this thing, thirteen hours, literally trying to think of how am I gonna get this done. And it, you know, it's, and I even I even had to pull the calculator out at one point to ask myself like. What do I is this worth doing? Because will I have will I be able to get the rest of the XP I need with the amount of MT I have? And I I was able to do it. So but yeah, let me go check out first of all, let's check out Kawhi's stats. Um whew, A plus inside mid range three ball playmakers A minus everything is A Except his IQ, which is we already know, it, 2K pitched that low initially to drop the like the, the reason this card probably isn't like a freaking 99 is because of his like basketball IQ. Rebounding is low too, so that's interesting. See defense 99, 94 offense. Um, yeah, okay. So driving layup 90, post fade 85, post drive foul, draw foul 80. 
mid range 85 three ball 894 so really strong shooter really strong shooting stats 94 you don't even need you just need like a diamond coach you don't even need a shoe or anything for Kawhi. well it may be a three shoe wouldn't hurt him but anyways I don't think you really need one. Okay, but driving dunk, 90, standard dunk, 80, free throw, 88. So, offensively elite, but not the best. That's why it's at 94. That's why it's 94. Not the most elite uh, offense, but obviously, like, what do you really need anything better than a catch-and-shoot driving small forward? Or he can play shooting guard, too. Interesting. Even better. 6-7 shooting guard, so even better. Um... But yeah, offensively, this core I think does everything you would need for a three. A two, I don't really know. His playmaking is a low. Pass accuracy is a little low. Defensive steal, 95. Perimeter, 95. Interior, 80. Block, 82. So everything is above 80. 80 and up. Um, rebounding is a little bit low for my liking. But if you're running him at the two, that's just perfectly fine. Or even three, that's kind of fine. 94 speed. So about the same. He's slower, actually, than... um. He's slower than, uh, what's his name? Carmelo Anthony. Pink Diamond glitch Carmelo Anthony. He's slower than that. But 94 speed is not bad. 90 speed with ball is not bad either. Um, Lateral quickness, 8, 98. So really elite defending. Like I said, 95 printer plus 98 lateral. I mean, it's a Kawhi Leonard. What do you expect? Um, Consistencies, 95 offense, 90 defense, which is actually weird to see. So that's not, I would have rather have liked to see 95 for both, but 90 defense. So it's a lot of things that I just don't like about this card um, already. I mean, I didn't look at the stats before grinding this card. I just wanted him. I just wanted him. So it didn't matter, right? But I know his Hall of Fame badges will make up for everything I don't like about him. So 22 Hall of Fame badges, 34 gold. So this is like 50-something 56 badges total. So, pretty much dang near everything in the game. Catch and shoot, relentless finisher, pickpocket, pick dodger, clamps, intimidator. Does he have... He does have... I didn't see corner specialist, so... It might be on gold. Trapper, contact finisher, tireless defender, showtime, downhill, quick first step, nice, handles for days, unpluckable. So, this kind of helps out his low ball handle. Um, range extender, steady shooter, so really, really nice badges here. Handles for days, unpluckable, quick first step, fast break finisher. I mean, like everything you could want. Like no useless badges here. Nothing here is useless. Um, difficult shot. And what I mean by useless is like if he had like, if he had like rebound chaser, Hall of Fame as a shooting guard, like that would be useless. Difficult shots. I still haven't seen corner specialists, so I'm assuming he he doesn't have it. Difficult shots. And I didn't see Hot Zone Hunter either. Hot Zone. Uh, yeah, I didn't see Hot Zone Hunter, so that's kind of. Hopefully, that's somewhere on here. Difficult shots. Pick and pop. Flashy passer. Break starter. Dimer. Chase down. See, um, more useless badges. I would say flashy passer. And. Kind of pickpocket. I mean, pick and pop because if he, he's running him if you're running him at the two um that's pretty useless if you're playing triple threat this has more value i guess for a triple threat but other than that like pick and pop is useless on him rebound chaser that's pretty helpful um on triple threat giant slayer protest break um bail out pass fake stop and go tight handles clutch shooter dead eye Green Machine, there's Hazel Hunter on go, um, volume shooter. So I knew I knew I didn't see corner specialists because it would have been at the top of the list for Hall of Fame and or go. So can't just shoot corner specialists is something he needs. Ankle breaker would be nice. He it's a couple of things that he need. He could be added on here floor general, and that's about it. Um, but yeah, ankle breaker and like corner specialists for sure he needs. But other than that, like. His release is solid. I've seen it. I've gone against this card quite a bit. Um, yeah. So he he he's that guy. So um, I don't really know where he fits at on my team. I guess he has to be in a starting lineup. Oh, I gotta rebuild my starting lineup because I basically demolished it. Wow. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay. Note to self: rebuild my lineup. <laughs> 
But anyways, okay, let's open up some of these packs, and I'll talk a bit more about what I went through. So, to summarize it, um, we pretty much was given time because of the snow i was able to i was given a i had a little bit more free time than normal because of snow um which a lot of states are dealing with right now and i was able to just knock out a ton of of ton of things on on these weekends so um i was already ahead like don't don't get me wrong i i, I didn't slack i just immediately was grinding i wanted when i saw Kawhi was the reward i wanted him from then on i said oh Kawhi is gonna be like a lockdown defender for sure gonna probably be an elite scorer i mean why wouldn't i grind for him right so i even have um i have Westbrook too um as well so i was like okay right, i wanna i wanna i wanna get Kawhi. so i'm gonna steadily you know every week i'm gonna grind a little bit Every time we get some new packs, I'm going to try to get the cheapest players and knock those challenges out, which I was doing. I was doing all of this. Um, and I think that if if you really want to get her, what's this Hall of Fame badge? If you really want to get Kawhi, I mean, not even Kawhi. I, I feel like it's too late now, obviously. Um, if I'm pin by the time this video comes out, it'd be way too late. But um, if you want to get to level 40, don't worry about the... um. Do not worry about those um packs, like player packs. Don't worry about like um idols flash packs, inferno packs or anything like that. Do those last. Work on everything else like moments cards. Work on the moments challenges. Work on um work on the weekend challenges. Work on those um token reward challenges. Work on spotlight challenges. Spotlight card um reward challenges um you know it's certain things that are beneficial other than buying like you don't have to spend money i feel like that was my biggest thing is when the after the first level when i didn't get curry i said oh man you gotta spend money to get this you gotta spend money and i didn't spend money this time so you know i didn't i haven't spent money this year so i'm pretty much did oh corn special slice. I pretty much did everything I've done um from my own MT just from playing this game. Just from playing this game alone. I used my MT to buy um the players I needed and I put them right back up and I pretty much um You know, just had to really work really smart. Sorry, I'm a little sluggish. Like I said, I've been literally streaming for 13 hours. So right now, my brain is fried. I need to lay down somewhere. Okay. But we got him. Um, I'm not even... I can't even do no gameplay right now. I'm just, like, sick of looking at 2K, actually, at the this very second. Um, But let me build my lineup real fast, and then I'm get out of it. I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to get out of here after that. Okay, the grind squad. So my whole lineup is from players I have earned. My starting lineup, anyway, is from players I've earned this season. Rusbrook, Kawhi. I got. I didn't earn these. I bought them this season. Is what I meant to say. And I also got cousins this season too. So. Yes, a lot, a lot of work. Because these two were 
over Cousins was near almost 200k. Com- Carmelo was close to like 150, 160k. Granger was probably the cheapest one in the pack, but uh, yeah. Anyways, um, yeah. Oh, and Jameson is also. I could throw him up there too, and that would make that more of uh, like you know. It's a lot of a lot of free opals this year. Westbrook. Well, I won't even. I'm not even gonna consider Kawhi a free opal. That man is 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 quite the grind. But uh, you know, Chicken Man here, Antoine Jameson. So. A lot of um, easy grinds, but I'm liking my team now. I finally feel like I'm caught up. Finally starting to get to that opal point um, with some competent opals on my squad. So, but anyways, man. Uh, yeah, it was fun. A little bit, but yeah, you just gotta be delicate delicate and and diligent actually let me say and just kind of grind man just just don't slack and what i mean by that is like do those weak challenges do those weak challenges do those um do those spotlight challenges man do those uh token rewards look look at here let me and then it's it's a bunch of stuff that's disappeared on her that you can't even see the work that i've done like daily challenges of course but it's a lot of other things here. Like I said, do them weak challenges, man. Do the, do the basic stuff. Do these player challenges right here. Kevin Durant, Trey Burke, all the way to Robert Covington, Kimba Walker. I mean, everyone, every, we got everyone done. Some of these were like weird because like, who has some, who said something weird? I swear someone has some weird. Covington, I thought, Covington scored 15 points on Triple Threat Online. Like who wants to do that? Spotlights. This is probably the easiest one. Um, but these were grind two twenty five threes. Um, you know, seventy five points. Nothing too crazy, but that does take time. Domination. This was through thirty games. A hundred. No triple threat. A hundred games of triple threat. That was tough. Domination was like thirty, right? Thirty games. Triple threat online. Luckily, I played triple threat online for fun, so this one wasn't too hard. Because I was just naturally play triple threat online, but you know everything else is. This is probably the most time consuming one. Is the diamond reward market, pink diamond reward market? These are insanely time consuming. And notice, I still have, I have still have plenty of XP to spare, and that's because I, like I said, a lot of my XP has disappeared. So yeah, but anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy, man. I want to drag this on, man. I'm ready to get to bed. Um, but yeah, um, Red Adversity, man. We're out. Please hit that like button, subscribe, man. The grind. I'm get some gameplay out for you guys tomorrow. This weekend on Beyond. So yep. Yeah. But like I said, we're gonna. Oh, also we're gonna be on tomorrow to talk about the new season, whatever is new. We're gonna be on here to talk about it. But anyways, for now, hope you guys enjoy, man. Red Adversity. <laughs> We're out this joint. Peace out. Please hit that like, subscribe button. Thank you for everyone that watched in the stream, too. Also, like I said, it's on my Twitch if you want to go watch it, man. Go go check it out if you want to see the, the grind. The last, like, the last 25, 28K or whatever it was. If you watched that, man, I, I planted it out a little bit in my head. Kind of did a little bit on the stream, too. But, like I said, man, we're going to verse man. We're out. Peace.